Today's accounts show that our balanced approach of protecting and supporting New Zealanders through COVID, combined with careful fiscal management, has been successful. There is no doubt that this has been a tough period for many households and businesses in New Zealand, and there are indeed still choppy waters ahead. But the strong set of accounts presented today mean that we are in a favourable position, especially compared to the rest of the world, to deal with the challenges of global slowdown and uncertainty. The global environment is challenging and it will continue to put significant pressure on the government's books and on New Zealand households and businesses. Like any, government, like any household, the government will carefully assess where we spend and where we invest. Careful and balanced management will be needed to keep us on a pathway back to surplus. And I reiterate, there is simply no room for unaffordable tax cuts to those who need it the least. Our focus will be on what matters most to New Zealanders, supporting their wellbeing and living standards. Questions? Yes. Why not spend some of that? <laughs> on tax cuts? Not on tax cuts. Because if we look at two things. Firstly, there's still a $9 billion deficit. So while the outcome is significantly better than had been forecast, we've still got some way to go to see ourselves return to a more stable fiscal position. Secondly, because there is still a great deal of need in our society to invest in health and in education and in housing. Um, we haven't completed the work that we need to do in lifting children out of child poverty. Um, there's still investments that need to be made. And thirdly, if I can add a third one in after saying two, um, thirdly, the global situation is so volatile. We do know that that will have an impact. So we've got high levels of corporate profit here, um, which turn into tax returns. They won't all last in all sectors. So this is a time for balance and caution, not for frittering away things through tax cuts to the wealthiest. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel to stay up to date with all the latest news from the New Zealand Herald. Click the subscribe button below or check out one of the videos here and head over to nzherald.co.nz for more details on these stories and more.